New Year's Eve this Thursday could mean that you need more good food, even if you have a small gathering. Chef Adam Edwards has some appetizer ideas. You're going to love looking good here, Adam. Good morning. How are you? I am good. Thanks for being with us today. I knew you'd have something delish to make for us. So what have you got in front of you there? Well, I, I'm, I'm going to try to do two recipes in one today, all right? Two in one. So uh, first thing what we're going to do is we're going to make a bruschetta. So what I've done is I've got some, uh, just some chunky bread that I've grilled and we're gonna top it with some delicious stuff. So we're gonna start off with uh, an aioli. Um, now this is not a traditional aioli, this is a, a quick aioli. So we're just gonna use uh, mayonnaise, garlic, olive oil, salt, pepper, um, and that's it. That's so easy. We're just gonna, yeah, it's pretty easy. Uh, lemon juice, a little lemon juice, so all you're going to do is you're going to mix all, all that up and you're going to get this yummy sauce that you could use for everything. Uh, but we're going to amp it up by putting in some gorgonzola. Oh, yeah. <laughs> amp it up. So once we get this mm -hmm. tossed together, we're just going to spread this on our toast here. I like the way you're going here, Adam. Now, for so, people who don't eat mayonnaise like Ron Rhodes, could you use uh, yeah. creme fraiche? Could you use yogurt? Could you use... Yeah, I mean, you could use... And basically, what I mean, you could even just smash up your blue cheese and not do anything else. Oh, this yeah, just, yeah. Uh, makes it a little bit creamier, but if, if you're not a, a mayonnaise fan, then, then that's fine. Okay, Ron. So what we're going to do to this is we're going to take some... Uh, roast beef tenderloin. Mm. If anybody's got some leftover tenderloin from Christmas, you just slice that up real thin and shingle that over the top. Love it. And it's like a, like a black and blue bruschetta. Looking pretty. Looking pretty. So you just take that, finish it off with some shaved uh, shallots. And that's it. Let's hear it for Adam. That's beautiful, Adam. That is beautiful. And the last one? Yeah. We have a minute for the last one? Yes, we do. So, you, <laughs> so last one we're going to do is uh, we're going to do a mini tostada. So I just picked up these little uh, round tortilla chips. Yeah. You're going to take a little, uh, I got some black bean, refried black beans. Just put that on there. I've got some cooked chorizo. Put some of that on there. Then you take some of this cotija. This is like a, a just a Spanish, uh, Mexican crumbly cheese. A little uh, pico de gallo right there. And you just put that on your little tray. Maybe That's... a little uh, fresh chili on there to garnish. Oh, Adam, it's go. gorgeous. Well, I mean, these are, your guests would love that or just you would love it yourself having the uh, a little small party at home. Beautiful job. Let's hear it for Chef Adam Edwards. Let everybody know how they can follow you. Uh, check me out on Instagram, Facebook, uh, Twitter, if you still do it, uh, at Chef Adam Edwards. Chef Adam Edwards, great recipes all the way around. We appreciate your talent. Happy New Year to you and your, camera, and your camera person. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Adam. Thank we'll, you. We'll be back with more local lifestyles right after this. Stay with us.